Jersey Sports Zone's coverage of Ewing and West Windsor Plainsboro North is brought to you by Princeton Orthopedic Associates. Mercer County Boys Basketball, Ewing taking on 5-1 West Windsor Plainsboro North. The first quarter is what most expected, a close back and forth battle between these two that ended with Ewing closing out the first with a 9-8 lead over West Windsor. Unfortunately, the second would not be as kind to the Knights. They struggled to get anything going in the opening minutes of the quarter, and Ewing capitalizing on those miscues, they start to pull away by winning the battle down low. Obi Agigo going to muscle his way in there to put the Devils up by seven to begin the second. Then Cameron Clark going to work the boards for the rebound, and you're going to need more bodies. Clark with the and one gives the Blue Devils a 20 to 10 lead midway through the second. And before the break, Keyshawn Preston not backing down, sends Ewing into the half leading 24 to 15 over West Windsor. Get your snacks ready because the second half will be the Shamar Robinson show. He opens up the quarter with an easy layup. Then a couple minutes later, Blue Devils with some good D force to turnover. And Robinson, not a TV watcher but loves reruns, gets his second bucket in less than a minute to put Ewing up 13 early in the third. And not much later, these are different plays, we swear. Knight's going to get picked once again. And Keyshawn Preston launches it up to who else? That's right, Shamar Robinson. He finishes at the rim to make it 36-18 Blue Devils with 3.57 to go before the fourth quarter. Ewing just opening this one up in the third quarter. They hit the 20-point mark for the lead, and Shamar Robinson says make it 22, hits the runner with ease, and the Blue Devils close out the third, leading West Windsor 49-27. to By the fourth quarter, it just seemed like he was showing off. Robinson with another drive, and this time he'll add one to it as he'll complete the three-point play to make it 51-29 Ewing early in the fourth. He's the hottest ticket in town, so the Knights are going to hone in on Shamar Robinson, but he'll still find a way to beat you. Draws a defender, gets it to Caleb Stokes at the three line, and get an umbrella. Stokes from far out to keep that lead at 20 for Ewing as we have just under six to go. It's been a dominating performance from the Blue Devils thus far. They're still up 20 late in the game, and Miles Reed says, I want one for the road. Reed getting three of his own after the shot with contact, and that's going to wrap this one up. 68-45 to is your final from West Windsor, Plainsboro North. The Ewing Blue Devils bouncing back after a tough loss to Trenton over the weekend. They improved to 5-4. and four. Shamar Robinson had himself a day. He finishes with 22. Look for Ewing in their next one when they take on Princeton. West Windsor Plainsboro North has their four-game win streak snap as they drop their second one of the season. They're now 5-2 and two and will look to rebound against Allentown. For Jersey Sports Zone, I'm Nery Rodriguez. Want to see highlights and features from your favorite school? Jersey Sports Zone is entirely supported by our great sponsors. Email marketing at jerseysportszone.com to get your business in front of our loyal audience and highlights from your hometown.